We're playing Kiss or Diss, because apparently if teenagers play Smash or Pass, the world will explode. Kiss! Kiss. Tch. Kiss or Diss sounds stupid. But then again, you're stupid, so... Diss. Bakugo, you're so rude! I don't want to kiss you either. I can't even see her, so how am I supposed to kiss her? <clears throat> if it makes you feel any better, Mina, I'd kiss you. What? What? Um... This? How the f Where are you even supposed to kiss? Jeez, everybody's getting awfully heated playing this game, and not just Kachan. Kiss. Well, that was a little weird, Majoria, but I'll let it pass. Who am I gonna get? This. <laughs> You'd be lucky to kiss someone like me, Ida. Unlucky for you, though, I don't want to kiss your stupid ass. Kiss. I feel kind of weird trying to decide if I'd kiss my classmates. Like, we live together and we spend all this time together. Dis. Not this bit. I don't know why you guys always make me play these weird games. I never understand them. Dis. Midoriya, you look like a piece of broccoli. Oh, Todoroki, you weren't actually supposed to diss them. Are you sure? Because when I chose kiss, I kissed them. You s*** away from me, Icy Hot. Icy Hot? But it's Thursday. I hate playing these games. No matter what you say, everybody takes it to heart. Okay, but who wouldn't kiss Todoroki? I think it's safe to say that I probably wouldn't kiss any of you. I'd kiss you to shut you up. You're awfully harsh with our class rep there, Froppy. I... Am I gonna kiss his beak? You're one to talk, Shoji. We're not even sure if you have a mouth under there. Have you seen those lips? Of course I'd kiss him. I don't like participating in games. Engaged by hormonal teenagers. Kiss. I wouldn't kiss any of you. The last thing I want to do is swap spit with any of my classmates. You are the only exception. Ah, oh, why am I last to go? I hope I get someone good. Pass. You're not a zuka. Kaminari, question. Answer. I have all the answers. I know every single answer in the entire world. I am God. Sure you are. Did he just use sarcasm? Yeah, yeah, I, th I think he did. What are you doing? Checking the sky. Why? To see if pigs are flying. Is it really that big of a deal? Hey man, we're just a bit surprised. What I really want to know is, who the heck did you get the sarcasm from? Plenty of people are sarcastic on a daily basis. Yeah, yeah, it's true, just, just not you. <laughs> Ida. Oh, hey Kaminari, hey Sarah. What's up, my little bro? Mind if I vent to Ida for a sec? Nah, you're fine. You want us to leave? Oh no, don't worry about it. Midoriya, what's troubling you? Hachan and I were training together and you know, we kind of knocked a building over and then he turns to me and he's like, what'd you do that for, you damn nerd? And I'm like, oh yeah, cause I'm totally the one with a giant blasting quirk that destroys everything every time I freaking train cause that's totally my fault. Oh, I get it now. Yeah, yeah, things are- things are making sense. <laughs> huh? Did I miss something? Ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> Tell you later. Okay. I'm definitely missing something here. Okay, but why does this official MHA story remind me of a fanfic gone wrong? <laughs> so essentially, a villain with a terrifying quirk came to town, and he turned everybody else into kids. Well, except Deku. Wait, so I've gotta be a babysitter now! Oh no! Aw, you guys! You're all so cute! Is that really you, Kachan? So Aizawa's taking care of the villain, but Deku's on babysitting duties. Midoriya, take care of the others until backup arrives. So, um, do you guys remember who I am? Little Baku goes like, oh man! Wait a second, I'm only 15! Their memories reverted too. Midoriya, one of them's heading for traffic. Get back here, Ayama, that's dangerous! Oh my goodness, you said still too, Kachan. We've got baby Momo here. Little Todoroki scared of the dark, aww. And Mineta's still on brand because he's looking at pictures of people kissing. Never mind, he never changed.
They're all playing and using their quirk. Deku saves little Bakugo and little Bakugo says, You're really strong, Deku. Bakugo says he wants to be just like Deku. How are you so cute? All right, listen up. Since I don't trust the girls to watch Eerie right now, I'm leaving her with you guys for the day. So you better watch her, keep her alive, and don't lose her. Watch her, don't lose her. What was the other one? I think it was keep her alive. I wasn't really listening, but honestly, I think we can handle it. Don't worry, Mr. Aizawa. She will never leave my eyesight. And one last thing. Make sure to keep everything age appropriate, please. Don't worry, we got this. So, Eerie, do you got a Snapchat I can follow Dude. you on? <coughs> no, she does not. Get out. What's a Snapchat? Oh, just ignore him. What would you like to do, Eerie? I want to make a TikTok. Of course she does. That's all we do now. And you're going to do it because that's what she wants to do. Let's go. Wait, who's going first? Let me go sex. Stop pushing. Shh, I can't hear. Okay, get ready, get ready. See, Bakugo? That wasn't even bad. You know what? Just shut up. It actually was fun. This is so exciting. I've been waiting for gym class. All right, everyone. My name is Coach B. Welcome to gym class. Question, can we use the little square scooter things and ride around on them? Coach B, Bakugo won't let me bench press him. I don't like being manhandled. Don't worry, bro. You can bench press me. Okay, no one is bench pressing anyone. Um, I hate to interrupt, but I broke my arm. You, literally how? We haven't done anything yet. I don't know, it just happens sometimes. Okay, um, everyone else, let's just go run a warm-up lap. <sighs> Todoroki, I know you can run faster than that. I am doing my best out here. Well, pretend that you're running away from your trauma. Okay, I can do that. Oh my god, he just lapped Ida. Wow, he's still going. Yeah, that man is not stopping anytime soon. By the way, I broke my other arm. Yeah, it was kind of like that. Oh my god, yeah, yes. So oh my god, I don't care about trials. I have no idea how I'm going to get all of it done. And then I looked at. Who in the fuck? Stop. Excuse me? Now, before you do whatever it is that you were planning to do right now, I suggest that before you yell at Midoriya or Shoto or Sarah or Mina, whoever you came here today to humiliate, you think about one thing. These people might be far from perfect, but you're not perfect either, Bakugo. I've never seen a stronger case of internalized homophobia when it comes to your actions towards Midoriya, saying that you hate him, but yet obsessing over him every single day and yelling at him and being in his face all the time, as well as getting mad at other people for not being able to measure up, but I hear you crying to Celine Dion almost every night in the common room when nobody's in here. In reality, Bakugo, your real problem isn't that you're angry all the time, it's that you don't accept yourself and so you project your problems onto the other people in class 1A and make them feel like sh**. The real solution to this isn't coming into the common room to yell at whoever you're mad at, but talking it out. So we're gonna stop our yelling right here, um, and we're gonna continue our day nicely. Alright, I'm gonna go make myself some tea. So Bakugo, would you like some tea? Um. Uh, do we have chamomile? Yeah, we have chamomile. I'll make you some. Do you like honey? Um, yeah, just some honey. All right. You want to talk in my room? Okay. Sit back, relax, and enjoy a healthy dose of prolonged eye.